It's all you. It's, it's all you, man. Larry, defensively, what did you kind of take away from this game, if anything? Uh, credit them. Uh, we tried some different things, and obviously we got to be better defensively, but they they made a lot of shots tonight, so credit to them. And uh, we're going to look at the film, what we can do better tomorrow, and that's the best thing about NBA. So we get to, we get a chance to redeem ourselves tomorrow. Do you, do you think you can be in pockets more aggressive um, within the offense, you know, just kind of, <laughs> hey, you know, not demanding the ball or not hijacking the offense, but just being a little bit more aggressive offensively. Uh, yeah, for sure. And I'm still learning that, kind of see wh where to get the, how to get the ball more. And uh, But like you said, just trying to play through the team offense. I think we got, that's the best part of our team to be able to move the ball and find the open guy and make, Everybody make decisions, and but yeah, I'm still trying to find my way to find the ball more and uh, get to a good spot, especially when you when you have it going. So, but I think we're still figuring each other out and getting better. What was it like being back? Oh, here, <laughs> it was fun. Uh, still talk to a bunch of guys from there, and uh, it was fun to see all the staff and. Still have a good good relationship with everybody, so it was a fun game. Obviously, hope the result would be a little different, but uh, it was good feeling to be back with the just, just whatever. I I heard the fans were kind of yelling my name and happy to see me again, so that felt good. But and like I said, just seeing all the staff and those guys on the team, so. It was fun, fun game, and so hopefully the next time we have a little better result. Larry, what are you missing when you don't have Kelly? Uh, I mean, he's big, like everybody. They're playing a big part of our role. It's just the way our offense is, and obviously his ability to make plays off the dribble and make shots and space the floor. And I think he's been good on defensively too, guarding the big guys, and so. Definitely miss him, uh, but we just got to find a way. Who knows? I, I don't know when he's going to play. I haven't talked to him about that, but I don't know how bad his injury was. So <laughs> just got to try to go day by day and figure out the figure out ways without him. And uh, like we talked about uh, earlier, I can't remember who was maybe it was Mike. Mike was out, and we talked about maybe in the long run. Uh, because that's part of the NBA. Like, in, unfortunately, injuries happen, and we've got to figure out ways and to come together and play still great basketball as a team, no matter who's in or out. So, <clears throat> in the long run, just having the experience playing without him, so it's going to be good for us. But definitely miss him. Yeah. Sorry, go ahead. Yeah, 22 in the first half. Well, I think 24 for the game. So. You know, defensively in the second half, I mean, you, you know what JB's defensive philosophy is and, and how their, their coach play defense. What what did you see from them defensively in the second half that resulted in them? Uh, they try to play physical, but I think we can still – we could have done a better job getting uh, – myself too, kind of, kind of forced a couple ones up, and so we just got to do it as a team in the second half as well like we mm – -hmm. I mean, our offense wasn't the best tonight. We can do a lot better than just digging us that hole the first half. It doesn't make it easy. Then we just try to make the, I think a couple times we were trying to make the home run plays rather than grind, grind it out. Uh, obviously, it doesn't, it's easy to fall into that when other team is making shots and we're not getting stops. So we're trying to make it, get a quick three or whatever. And just, <clears throat> but we'll learn, learn from that and try to get a better one tomorrow. Thank you.